Hi, my name is Dr. Carla Soto and I'm from Boca Raton. Today I'm going to give you an expert tip on short Invisalign treatment to optimize restorative outcomes. And this is a really cool case because it's kind of those examples of when we really look at a case and the patient wants a smile design, but um, the teeth are sort of straight, but they're not quite there where we need them to be. And if we want to be minimally invasive, we go through whole like digital workflows to see where we want to be at. And at the end of the day, we just go through just minimal treatment that takes us to, you know, basically where we want to be, balanced with the teeth, balanced with the gums. And when she came in, she, this is, she, she was breaking her restoration, some old composites, opaque. They were leaking. And um, we just did some quick Invisalign and we um, aligned, we increased the overjet. We just made sure that we were in the safe zone so that we could do restorations. And the cool thing about this is that this really allowed me to prepare less, go like not going to dentin, and really allow for really nice function while I was doing this mild design. After six weeks of Invisalign, we were able to align everything we see in this occlusogram that we have no red marks on the anterior teeth, which is great. And then we have that alignment, and once we're done with that, we follow digital workflows and we do the, all the preparations and the scan of the preparations and we're able to deliver you know, some beautiful porcelain like this. I think the best part of this is not just um, you know, the result and a happy patient. I think the best part of this is really that we're doing the right thing, even if it takes a little bit longer. This particular patient is um, a model and she's gorgeous. She truly had a beautiful smile before. There were some functional problems. She was breaking things and that's why, where we come in. And when a patient comes to you that they want to smile and they want it now, even if you can buy a little bit of time, it's really going to maximize what you're uh, conserving. Uh, it's going to maximize your results. It's going to even out and distribute the spaces in, in a much more harmonious, beautiful way. And as you can see in this particular slide, on the top we can see opaque composite that was leaking, that was violating the biological um, width. And in the bottom you see the porcelain. And this is only one week after delivery, so we can definitely expect some more tissue healing, but this is only six weeks of Invisalign plus 10 veneers. At the end of the day, the most important thing is, you know, the portrait and the face and that everything is balanced and in harmony with the face. And, um, you know, we were joking that she wanted a Julia Roberts smile. She wanted this like celebrity smile. And when I do this comparison, I can really tell that actually, I think she looks better than Julia Roberts. So at the end of the day, we do all of this to deliver the highest quality, but I think the most important thing is to have fun with it. So um, having a happy patient really, really um, in increases everything, but at the end of the day, it's just being able, able to deliver function, aesthetics, and biology. Thank you so much. And that's my expert tip.